I tell you what I wanted to get done. I wanted to get some um, brand T-shirts done yeah. by the time, but I didn't have enough time to do it. Because I thought it would be kind of cool to have like. Oh, and the idea was it's major nuts is like a superhero, isn't he? This is that's the yeah. thing, the the superhero major nuts, and this is his soap. This is his soap. I got to pick up a color scheme for major nuts as well, because there was this thing where. I did a red version and, and you said it looked like the Omni-Man yeah. thingy from whatever I think like green and red for Wales but greens to like Omni-Man and I was going to have the green instead of the red because it obviously is obviously it's a totally yeah. different character it doesn't look like that he hasn't just taken a picture of him and changed the, the cape colour yeah. exactly just Superman but with soap written on his chest <laughs> <laughs> it's got handmade in Wales on there in big old letters it's got the dragon on the side it's going to have that to you made it what do you mean the dragon on the side, they're made in Wales. Yeah. So all of my com all of my um, my products are going to have a made in Wales symbol. Yeah. Oh, you designed that yourself. And, and hopefully, it's going to become a thing where other people want that logo, made in Wales logo. I'm they... sure many other people have their own. And yeah, but I want to create like a little community of made in Wales shit. But the thing is, you'd have to be an established brand. Like they'd want to be associated with you. Who doesn't want to be associated with major nuts? <laughs> and I like the thing is this brand is very much we can say fucking cunty bollocks in this video. Yeah, and that, that's that's yeah, that's on want. point with what well, bonus soap, morning wood, eucalyptus, eucalyptus, menthol as fuck. So eucalyptus is, I was originally gonna call lick your liptus. Until I found out, until I googled the word liptus and was like, oh that does actually mean mercy. And I was like, uh, people might not get it. Another Lictus, word. What is that like? The scientific word for vagina? What? I don't know. When I googled well, it, it was, it was it was something. It was it was the representation. Clip mop. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is like we're targeting yeah. obviously a bit of a male crowd with yeah. this. Yeah. It was another one. It was lick your. It was a uh, lick your own nuts. <laughs> lick your own nuts. I'm sure that works. It's, it's sort of like carry on. Maybe like like if you broke down mental as fuck, but it's like the old British carry on humour. It's rude, but it's not calling it like I don't know boner bubbles. Cock. Yeah, Cock. yeah. It's like Cock morning sure. wood. Yeah. Is yeah, not boner bubbles. It's it's mischievous. Yeah. Yeah. It's not quite fucking cunty bollocks. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, maybe maybe that's a product design later yeah. for in the future. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, so this is the first time I'm going to do a market. I'm really, really both excited and a little bit nervous. But yeah. I, I don't know why I'm nervous because if I don't. What, sell like, so how soap, many bars of soap have you got? I guess how much? I've got anywhere between eighty and one hundred and twenty. How long is the fair tomorrow? What time does it start? Start, well, we get there, eight o'clock-ish, yep. set up, yep. and then we're gonna have a little bit of time to ourselves until they let people in at 10. Yep. So for then 10 till, it's gonna like 10 till five. Okay, but then I'm being dumped at the train You're station. You're being dumped at the train station. In plenty of time. In plenty of time. Milford Haven. Yeah. When I'm ready to go, I'm just gonna pack up when I'm ready to go. Yeah, really. so unfortunately I won't be there the whole day. I'll be leaving tomorrow no. afternoon about three it's, it's, it's a bit of a shame, but it's really good, actually. So 120 bars, how much you sell one bar for? Six pound. So six pound. How long does it last? Give or take how many how many times you use it, you know. Say um, once a day. I go to the use gym, it once shower a day, every day. Anywhere between twenty-one days plus. You know, about twenty one twenty one to twenty eight so days. A month. Be, a month, about a month. It's very much this is a pampering product. The thing is, it's not a pampering product per se, because men don't really do pampering products, but it's a product well, it's a self love yeah, product. Yeah, it's 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 a it's a product for a man who is a bit more eco-conscious, you know, everything in there is either organic. Well, that's not me. Yeah. <laughs> no. It's either organic or it's in a certified- Well, I, um, I do try and live cleanly with, say, yeah. my food and other things I do. It's in very much in line with that. Yeah, so it's 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 very much it's like, like that. It's completely it's, natural. So there's so there's nothing there's no nasty synthetic ingredients that's gonna fuck with your hormones, you know. And also it's a little bit funny. It's so you can get behind, you know. You're sort of like, oh hey, look, I'm gonna go rub myself with the morning wood. Well, for me, it's any time I, especially say they're not drinking and having more money to spend stuff on myself. And it's like say gym kit. You buy yourself good gym kit. It's like you're investing in yourself. Yeah, exactly. And things rather than say spiraling bad, like getting drunk and depressed and fighting and your life spiraling down. I think things spiral up and it sounds silly I'm not saying a soap can do that but 
if you spend that bit extra and get a really nice soap and you smell good it makes you feel good you then want to wear nice clothes you then want to try harder and work harder so you can buy more nice things for yourself and other people it will make you want to get out to the gym it will make you more active it's hard to describe and it's not just like say the soap was like going to the gym does that doing something productive like even just coming up with this idea probably gave you a buzz and did all that it really is like I think yeah this look, co- looking after yourself and self-love and treating yourself to stuff it's like yeah I'm buying this to look after myself and feel good uh, and, like, and like there's well I'll say no price you can put on that I am um, although six pound is a good start <laughs> yeah for a month of luxury soap yeah it depends how long of showers you it have smells like bloody good well I and when you it, think I like, I I s- be, if you've got a soap that smells really strong yeah because my soap doesn't smell strong I think it's quite subtle well it's not like walking into the lush shop oh God, and no, you like yeah. but if you put the bar in your nose and sniff it that's what I was doing yeah exactly. if you put the bar in your nose and sniff it then you can smell it exactly so I smell morning wood and I was like but, I mean is that cedar wood in that one there is cedar wood uh, like it's sandalwood sandalwood cedar wood. I think that's they're both. the two that I like yeah. like the sandalwood it's cedar wood it's patchouli and it's a little bit of piney and I smelled that and I thought this is brilliant it's got the best product in the world and then you sent me the others and like menthol was just great because I would have that in the morning like yeah, if I it's, if a like, good, it's a good one. do you know what my favorite one is like tea tree and mint what it's peeling good is my favorite one you see I smell it's a bit orangey like yeah, citrusy I like, I, like, I, like, I like I like orange I liked ones. it I liked it I preferred the other I preferred morning wood and the mint one because the other one you have to block this this out the other one was going to be called But, I, but I, that's I, racist. <laughs> <laughs> and the other one was going to be called Whiskey Dick. But again, that's and that's I, like and I was gonna, not even. Yeah. That's not even. And I was yeah, going to make just... it with real whiskey. Oh, hang mm. on, but surely that get expensive. A bit more expensive, but because it's made more, I got to charge a little bit more. It'll be like a hero product. As oh, they call a hero it. product. Yeah. So how many we got? We got 120, 120 bars. 120 bars. Okay, um, I'd be happy if I sold 20 of them because 20 bars of soap would break me even for the month. Well, it might be quite quiet. Like, it might be quite quiet. What I mean is that there's, I think we're going to fill a market for like presents for blokes. Uh, I'm not imagining there are going to be a lot of there's things that expect blokes. Father's Day is coming up. Yeah, I am aware. So I think yeah. we should play the Father's Day angle. You watch, and... Your dad's going to get a couple of bars of soap. Like, oh, dad, look, I'm putting soap. <laughs> <laughs> I can't imagine what what is what are at country fairs for guys like not a lot so that the people might be buying stuff for themselves it would say the least sexist as possible but like what what do guys want from there like nothing and right. even if you got them soap it might be like a nice natural soap but it's not going to be a hilarious product like this so that uh, you I think yeah. you've really got like a niche thing appearing at this Tenby Deer Park oh it's, yeah I think fair. so, as so well. I I hope that that will really help you tomorrow. Yeah, I hope so. Because the thing, I wanted a T-shirt that said, um, "Have you seen I'm my morning stupid. wood? <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen my morning wood and stuff nah, like that?" You know. Yeah, good. Just good, sort good, of good. Like, good. But I, I couldn't get it in time. Is yeah. Really. This market has sort of popped up out of nowhere. All of a sudden, I've had to like change my public liability insurance for me as I'm well. For, it. for me as well. Like, it's just, yeah, I was. I've been to the, the, I've day, been like, to the make great. Oh, this is bonkers! How like a conversation was like, oh hey, what are you doing this weekend? Oh, I got the makers. What day is it? It's free. Friday. Was it Monday? We're having that conversation. Tuesday, Wednesday. That's when I ended up going to America. Yeah. So here we go. Sirens, traffic. Well, at least the sirens are going the other way. Right. Okay. We're gonna go to Tesco. We're gonna get through this traffic. We might go out for dinner. We'll get healthy food for tomorrow. Yeah. Right. Major nuts coming at you. See you later. <laughs> Woo!